the Senate Finance Committee has also already passed the Fostering for Success Act. Yeah, really, really proud of the committee hearing yesterday. It was a special moment for me. I actually went to the committee room and made the presentation myself. It brought me back to my old days of being a house rep and, and certainly missed, missed those times of presenting a, a big idea to, to a committee. Grateful for them passing it. And yeah, we've worked a lot on foster care since we've come in three, three years ago uh, because, you know, who else is going to fight for them? Uh, and so our life, uh, my family has, has really kind of been a part of this foster uh, care learning experience. My son, my oldest son, Parker, is now a sophomore at UGA, and, and he's had some intersections in his life where he's got to meet some very uh, good friends that have been part of the foster care system. This specifically focuses on kids that age out of the foster care system. So as I explained to the finance committee, just imagine you're 18 years old, your birth certificate says you're an adult, but you're not ready for, for, for tackling life or you know, putting your own you know, roof over your head or, or being able to take on a job. This is an opportunity for us to, to create a tax credit for $20 million to give wraparound services through approved agencies to help these kids navigate through the difficult parts of early life. That they don't have a family to pick up the phone and call when they hit some sort of crisis or health concern or just, just, you know, just need a, an arm to, to, to wrap around them and give them a hug and help them to their next opportunity.